obviously, charge is one of a capital offense. Magistrate courts in Belize are not allowed under the crime control law and um, ancient tradition not to grant bail unless, of course, there was an admittance by the police that they have not had any kind of information. Um, so Mr. Pacheco, most unfortunately, has been remanded until August um, out of a matter which I guess by now you would have done the wrongs and found out that an unfortunate argument escalated and he felt he had in the circumstances um, no choice but to resort to protecting himself by his licensed firearm. No? Here is an incident in which one man goes to prison, another goes to the cemetery and the families of course are going to be left to pick up the pieces for a long time. What sort of um, facts at least in the summary um, phase right now are police saying that they have against your client? The police are saying that, um, I will read for you what they say, the surveillance footage was viewed and obtained, which is not saying anything. Um, it doesn't say that on the surveillance camera information is enough for us to have brought a charge. They say that they have recorded a statement from an eyewitness, but my information from the family, from family members, is that fact eyewitnesses on behalf of Mr. Pacheco has not even been approached for a statement. Um, other than that, the police are merely saying, as they are required to say, that Mr. Vian Waver and our sympathies goes out to his family, received um, about three or four injuries to his arm and to his abdomen and to his side or something of that nature. No? So there may have been more than one shots fired in relation to the matter. But nothing much is being said in terms of the police report. Sir, I know that um, at this stage, attorneys loathe to get into particular details. I am one of those. Indeed. Um, but the family of the victim has asserted strongly that they don't believe in any way that uh, Mr. Villanueva threatened Mr. Pacheco's life for him to have resorted to the use of his licensed firearm. What's, uh, do, you, do you care to make any uh, responding comments? Yes, I would say that fortunately in our justice system, the facts will be brought to court and we will all get an opportunity to hear exactly what transpired as best we can from witnesses from both sides. But certainly we are of the view that the charge of murder is a bit excessive in the circumstances. They ought to have been charged for manslaughter and granted bail, but time will take care of that matter.